Attribution refers to the process by which we explain not just other people's behavior, but our own as well. And there's a lot of things you'll want to know about attribution in terms of how we do this. First of all, you'll want to know the difference between two types of attribution, dispositional and situational. Dispositional attribution is when you explain someone's behavior as saying that that's who they are. They engage in that behavior because that represents who they are as a person. If it's a situational attribution, what you're saying is a person engaged in the behavior because of the environment, because of the situation itself. Something caused them to do that. So dispositional and situational attributions. Um, let's say that you are in traffic. Let's say you have road rage like I do and uh, you are driving down the road and someone is driving really slowly in the left hand lane they're just taking their sweet time and it really bugs you well you might make a dispositional attribution and say what an idiot that person is a stupid horrible driver I can't believe they're allowed to live and you might say all kinds of horrible horrible things that are dispositional attributions you're saying this behavior comes from the fact that that's a bad person it's got something to do with who they are or maybe you make a situational attribution. Maybe you say to yourself, all right, that person's driving slow in the left-hand lane. There must be a reason. Maybe uh, their steering wheel is having difficulties. Uh, maybe they're getting ready to turn left in a few minutes, and I don't know that yet. But what you're doing is you're explaining the behavior not by who they are, but because of the situation itself. Now, the fun part of this is that depending on what culture we're talking about, we have a tendency to make different types of attributions for ourselves and others. In individualistic societies like America, we're much more likely to make uh, dispositional attributions for our own successes. So when we do something well, we attribute it to the fact that we worked hard, we're smart, we're good dancers, we're great at something. But when something bad happens, like we fail a test, we tend to say things like, ugh, that test was too hard, uh, that professor is a jerk, I hate the school, things like that. So we have a tendency to, to make different types of attributions. You will want to be familiar with the fundamental attribution error. The fundamental attribution error, or the FAE for short, occurs when we are more likely to make dispositional attributions for other people's mistakes. So if uh, you're at a drive through and you're at the Taco Bell drive through and uh, you say your order, and they get it wrong, and they're really just incompetent in your opinion, it turns out, especially in individualistic cultures, we are more likely to say that you're messing up because you are stupid, you're a bad employee, there's something wrong with you. Um, we don't make situational attributions as commonly. So that's the, the fundamental attribution error. Um, when you fight this, the trick is to try to switch to situational attributions when dealing with other people and to say, wow, maybe they're just having a bad day. Maybe they just lost a loved one. Maybe that's why they're a little slow with my food order. So um, that can help us with our frustration, with our stress, and with some other things. But make sure you know attribution means explaining people's behavior. Dispositional attribution means explaining in a way that says it's because of who you are. Situational attribution is when you explain something due to the circumstances, due to the environment. And the fundamental attribution error is when we're more likely to make a dispositional attribution about someone else and their mistakes.